Hey guys, and welcome back to another frugal living and frugal loving video. If you guys are anything like me, it is absolutely stupid how much money I spend on coffee. Now, I have gotten a lot better, but when I was in my heyday, especially working outside of the house, it was just straight up sinful how much money I was spending. You calculate a Starbucks run every morning at five and six dollars per cup, and it's ridiculous. It's over $100 a month. So one thing about working from home is that it gave me the opportunity to buy what I liked at the store and make my own coffee every morning instead of running out to Starbucks, Dunkin', Scooters, or whatever. Not only do you save money, but you save time and fuel as well. So I'm going to give you a quick little overview of how I make my perfect cup every morning. Okay guys, so even though I'm a bit of a coffee snob, I'm going in with some instant coffee. I know that may just hurt some of you all's feelings. I get it, but I use the Folgers instant coffee and it is so good. I also added some great value Splenda to that. And I'm going in with a little bit of Coffee Mate Snickers. Now my creamer choices, it definitely varies. I try to pick a new creamer every week or week and a half when I get finished just to experience something different, but I am a creamer fanatic. I give it a good mix and of course pour some boiling hot water from my kettle in there. You guys, it is so good. But if I really want to get a little fancy schmancy with it, I add in this foaming whipped cream um, that is kind of made for coffees. I got it actually in the coffee section just to get everything, you know what I mean? Give it that little vibe, that coffee shop vibe. Sometimes I will go in with the Hershey's caramel syrup. Honestly, I don't go in a lot with that because it makes it a little sweet. But this is how I make my quick cup every morning. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.